Jerry with Happy Place Diaries and I'm back out in the trailer and I want to show you three things that well they're not necessarily upgrades but they sure do make life a little bit nicer in the trailer so uh, stick with us also stick around to the very end I have a real special message for you that um, could help you and save somebody's life stick around Hey, once again, we're back at home. We're getting ready for our next trip, and I was just out of here. I opened up the door, and I was greeted by a nightlight that we have installed. And I thought, well, this is something that I should share. Not just that nightlight, but there are three lights that we have added to our trailer that make uh, it a little bit more secure, a lot more safe, and it has added a little bit of convenience to the way that we go about our business, especially at night in the trailer. These lights are really inexpensive. Picked them up at the Walmart and I'll show you the first one. And the first one is this. And the we install this outside. There's a mount that we keep on, on the outside of the trailer. It mounts just like this on this nice little magnetic clip it's directional in that it's on this magnet and it's charged by USB and it's got three settings on off and auto and I won't blind you but I just switched it to auto it has a sensor right here so it's a motion light and boy, it lights up the step outside. And I'll show you, we mount that right outside. It's really nice when you walk up on the trailer, it lights up and we have it pointed down. So it lights up the entire step area, but we're not gonna blind you. We're not gonna put it in your face. So that's our first one. That's our security light outside. And yeah, we had to put this on our checklist to make sure that we remove this uh, because this is the second one we've had to buy. So we have the mount right here next to the door and we just turn it to auto and then aim it where we want it. And that lights up the stair area. So that makes it just a little bit safer when we're stepping into the trailer at night. It also might be a deterrent if somebody wants to come up and mess around with our trailer at night, it's gonna light up. Now when we're driving, we store it right here. And it's nice because we keep it on auto. And I just kind of have it aimed down like this. So if anybody does come into our trailer at night, this thing is going to light them up. Okay, let's check out the other two. So in the bathroom, we've installed this light right here and we put it right above the cabinet and I've got it turned off right now because it will definitely blind you. But it too is on a magnetic mount and there's your light, there's your sensor. And again, it's on auto on and off. And this thing is a beauty. The reason I really like this is because of the the shape, when we have it on, we kind of just tilt it up. And that way it's not in your face when you open the door. The nice thing is the motion sensor, as soon as you open the bathroom door, it turns on. You don't have to turn on this light when you get up in the middle of the night. And so it just shines kind of on the ceiling, lights up the bathroom and it makes for a convenient light at night when you're in the bathroom. Then our final light is this night light right here. This is probably my favorite. When the dogs come up and down the stairs off the bed, it lights up. When you open up this door coming in, it automatically lights up. The sensor 
uh, catches you right there. Look at that sock needs to go inside. The other thing that I really like about this light is it comes off of that mount. Turn this off. Okay. Little light works on AAA batteries. But the other thing that I like about this, the proximity to the bedroom, it's right there. So when you get up, you don't need to turn on lights. This light here does not have a switch. You have to turn it on by using the switch on the light. But if, if needed, this has a flashlight built in to the top. And so you have a nice little flashlight also. But I love the motion sensor and it just lives. Turn it back to auto and it's on. And the light just lives there and going down the road, it never comes off. It it rides real nice right there. I've got the mount held on with command strips. And it just is a super sensor light. As a bonus, we've also added these lights to the bottom of our sturdy steps. And when they are extended, they come on at night as you approach. Now this one's not going to come on now because of the daylight, but this one did. So and they're all battery operated. I have them held on with command strips and uh, makes it really nice and convenient. So these lights, you know, again, uh, picked them up at Walmart. Uh, they were really inexpensive uh, in the grand scheme of things. They're battery operated, so you don't have to be an electrician uh, to hook them up. They add a little bit of safety. They add a little bit of security, but they add a whole lot of convenience as you're kind of moving around your trailer at night, uh, inside and out. Hey, folks, uh, I want to share with you a an app. If you have a friend or a loved one that is going through uh, PTSD or depression or, or any of those mental issues, uh, it is called Family Coach. And it's available on the App Store and I believe it's available on the uh, Google Play Store. Uh, it is not for uh, the person that is going through PTSD. It's for family members and friends uh, that are going through this with somebody that's going through PTSD. Uh, there'll be links in the description below. Uh, the app looks like this. And so I would encourage you, if you are the friend or a family member, loved one, somebody that just cares about somebody that's going through PTSD, download this app. It's absolutely, absolutely free. And it will walk you through things that you can do to help. Maybe give you a better understanding of what that person's going through. And uh, it might just help save their life. So anyway, check out the app. It's absolutely free. And I highly encourage you to check it out it might be extremely helpful for somebody that you love. Again, thanks for watching the video. I know it was a quick one, just showing you a little bit of stuff that we do to make RVing just a little bit better. Uh, we appreciate each and every one of you. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Uh, give us a thumbs up if you like the video, but most importantly, uh, share it with a friend. Appreciate each and every one of you. Thanks for coming along.